we know a horizontal projectile is nothing but a body projected horizontally with a velocity u from a certain height like from a tower it's having an initial velocity u we have proved in the previous post that it takes a path of parabola we want to calculate what is the velocity after a certain time say after some time what is its velocity after some time after some time it will have different velocities both along x axis as well as y axis because initially it has no initial velocity because you have given horizontally all the velocity is only along x axis but as the time progresses gravity starts acting along y direction therefore body starts acquiring velocity along the y direction so i want to calculate first of all vy velocity of the body after some time and vx velocity of the body after some time i have a simple equation to use to solve this v is nothing but u plus at so let us say along x axis v is nothing but u plus at vy is not vx is nothing but ux plus ax into t ux is only u there is no acceleration acting along x axis that means velocity of the projectile along the x axis is going to remain constant let us calculate about y axis along y axis i will use the same formula v equal to u plus at vy equal to uy plus ay into t there is no initial velocity along y direction ay is nothing but acceleration due to gravity plus g because it's acting along the direction of the motion and increasing the velocity so vy is nothing but equal to gt so if i have to say what is the velocity of the body after some time i have a formula v bar is vx i cap plus vy j cap vx is nothing but as i have proved u vy is nothing but gt j cap how much its magnitude is i can calculate magnitude of that vector is root of x component square and y component square where it is it's somewhere like this v it can be resolved into components vx and vy like whatever we have calculated it's making some angle some alpha with the horizontal i can calculate then tan alpha is nothing but vy by vx alpha equal to tan inverse of vy by vx we have calculated vy and vx so this is how the velocity is going to make a certain direction after a specified time in the case of a projectile projected from a certain height initially with only horizontal velocity that's what i would like to prove thank you